Yeah, this is kind of the stage I was expecting uh, to come out from Toad. I think Stadium really benefits Pelotena. Um, she has a lot of room to work with. She can do, you know, cancels off these platforms. Uh, I just like this stage for Pelotena more than the battlefield. Yeah. The battlefield. The one yeah. and only. Hell yeah. You know, we have the battlefield. We have a final destination. We have, uh... We have three FDs, I must say. Oh, Whoa, read the really jump! Good. That was nice. You're gonna continually go for callouts probably pretty similar to the Toad matchup. His Ike really does like the individual game plan that it has been going off of that we've seen, so... Plus, being able to have just watched the set, he might have gotten a little bit of game knowledge for like what he was going to go for before the set began. In fact, I think that's already played into the way that this, this set has gone. A lot of Plutz's first stock was just kind of knowing exactly where he would be, but not necessarily on account of, oh, he's adapting. He might have just watched him play and said, oh, th this will work. I know where we're headed. <laughs> it's like uh, reading ahead in school where you just like skip the chapter and then the teacher's going over the next day and you're like, I already know this. I, I can I can relate to that a bit too much. <laughs> oh, gets the jump caught with the neutral beam. That's gonna take that stock. That was really good. Uh, just taking the jump. I just got a jump, like not with like too much uh, vertical height down. They, that's pretty much a dead eye, especially with the uh, counter like policy. Even if they help you, you're just dead. Plus, I like the. Sorry, go ahead. I like that the game plan coming out from Plus has kind of been to play more aggressive than we saw coming out from Toad. Uh, he's kind of getting in Hugh's face and oh. killing him with a side B. That was, uh, I didn't think he was going to die there. He's kind of getting in Hugh's face and trying to challenge him up close instead of trying to play reactively, reactive and defensive, yeah. which is playing paying dividends off the plus. Uh, I'd like to see Hugh make a couple of aerial adjustments. Uh, he seems to be kind of in this rhythm of he'll hop a set number of times before he'll throw out an aerial. Um, he might need to play a little bit more defensive because plus has been catching those very, very well. He definitely yeah. won the first game, so we'll see what he does. I think you like just in terms of, like stage wise, I think he's going to try to go back to like the battlefield just because he just won three games in a row versus uh, Peach and Palu on battlefield. And he seems really comfortable on that in this matchup. Uh, so we'll oh Crom. Crom. Yeah. But I don't know if what I said about battlefield is true, just because Paulo gets a lot off this platform. So I think we're gonna see something like that. Three, two, one, well, I couldn't go. think of something, but yes, <laughs> yeah. This makes sense in my eyes. Uh, you're you can run a lot faster than Palutena can as Krom, and uh, so you can close gaps earlier, and then you still have a lot of room to work with if Palutena gets you off stage. Uh, you can like weave in and out of her stuff and live a long time as Krom. Looking like melee out here. You can certainly move very quickly. Yeah, he's been he's been moving everywhere. You know, Hugh, Hugh seems out. like a like he always likes to move. Like no matter what's going on, he's moving in some capacity. He's actually yeah. usually even faster than this. He's been dealing with some hand pain as of late. So that can make it a little bit trickier when you want to move this much this frequently. You're telling me you doing that with hand pain? <laughs> oh, I mean, this crazy. It must be zoomer. You can only really wave dash defensively in this game, though. Doing it aggressively will just get you killed. Yeah, I've seen it like move occasionally. Oh, bird. What's yeah, up, Bird Kid eighty five? How you doing? Bird. 
Just, you need to lag spike the bird so it doesn't chirp until after this scream is over. I'm sure if you reset the router, the bird will understand. Oh Alright, so while we are dealing with Cool Kid's bird, uh, we saw <laughs> you take a stock with a reverse up air. Like, just kind of threw it out out of disadvantage and it took the stock. That's kind of what he's been hoping for these last two games is kind of to play to get a like random defensive option as a kill which i don't think it's a very um sustainable game plan to say the least surprise though it got him this far that's that is a big way that he plays he like he really likes his falling aerial like where he'll try to like cross you up with falling up air or whatever with the swordy characters i've noticed that, people, yeah. he plays zard obviously way different than this but it doesn't change the fact that he knows exactly what to fish for and when. I think he, like, gets that from playing Ivy on the side. I honestly think that's where it comes from. That makes sense. Yeah, I haven't seen uh, too much of you really play, but he seems to uh, just you know, not play a decent amount of characters and pick them up. Like, you say he plays uh, Charizard and he plays... He mains Zard. Like, His Zard yeah, is insane. <laughs> he's been playing Ike and now he's, like, dumb and just seems like really... Really like good all around. All yeah, he he has the right practice mentality. Like he figures out what the best thing to go for with the characters is, and he will make it happen. Yeah, you know, I see what you mean. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Yeah, it's a dead Um, yeah, that reminds me of just uh, like right now too. Uh, He's been uh, more scared to just like go off stage and like hit. Uh, oh uh, no! That's unfortunate. Uh, that's go. that's the crumb. It it sometimes your recovery just won't go the way you need it to go. That was very unfortunate timing to say the least. I know that feel. I was a crumb main when the game came out. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> The pain you must feel just like getting countered on ledge five times as like playing Krom. Well, it it's it's Krom feels the same, I would imagine, as like any individual spacey main feels when it yeah. comes to melee, right? Like you have all of these insane options you can do. Sure. But your recovery needs to be worse. If your recovery wasn't something you had to work at, then you'd just be nuts busted. Like, there'd be no yes. point. And, and it kind of comes with the territory. Like, you're going to know that your opponent's game plan is going to be to take advantage of your bad recovery. So you have to play around to that. But no bad recoveries here. We're going to be seeing the switch to Joker. Q just plays every good character. And Charizard. Who's also good. <laughs> Charizard's sick. <laughs> I love Charizard. Charizard's sick, but like, he plays an incomplete trainer and he knows it and he just doesn't care because he's good enough to make it work. <laughs> Which I is love people like that. Wild. There was a there was one like that back in my old region with uh, Ivysaur specifically. You, Ivysaur, I play trainer, but Ivy's so boring. <laughs> Wow, Ooh, it's a lead on the half match. Well, that's that's a Joker thing, I think. Like, you run into a Joker, and the first time they get to ledge, set, or pretty much you saying, oh, you know what, you're probably going to do Rising Aerial of some kind, like a fair <laughs> or whatever. He did a Nair. I actually didn't expect that. But I'm just going to call out your Aerial at me because I'm standing a little too close. That was a good call out by Shelter. It was a well played. Yeah, absolutely. Plus, he's kind of playing out of his mind right now. He's like Plus throwing out good, all these, dude. yeah, he's throwing all these counters, like in just in neutral that are always hitting. He got that read on the F smash. He tried to go for a downer that last stock, like. And also, like you just gotta like have like you gotta understand because Plus has like probably so much confidence right now, sitting in losers finals, up two games, knowing that your opponent has like tried to counter the character's device. Like, you know they're not playing the main, so you must have, like, so much confidence going into this. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like, you know Especially they haven't figured you out yet. 
and you get to kind of roll with it. It's nice. Yeah. You're just gonna like push buttons and you're, you're not really scared. You know, because like you can see, like, plus, plus is just been like, you know, you're really confident on just like, these and all, just everything. It's been on top of it, and you can, you can see that. It's really been showing. Oh. Wild F smash. That'll, you know what? He needed that. That was, if he's, if he's gonna have something that got him back into the set even remotely, that was it. Yeah. Plus has taken this momentum really far. You know, that's something to see out of. I don't know if it's just a follow thing Plus does, but like, he takes that momentum and he you know, pushes it as far as he can, but he knows what back. Yeah, it's sort of like you're playing Palo, you know that you have. Oh, wow! Oh, oh I forgot this. Yeah, he needed the double dip. The double dip is how you get back all the way back into the set. That's how you reverse 3-0, but it was that close. Like, now, plus not getting cheese here, he'll probably play a little bit more cautiously the rest of the set. Or not the rest yeah. of the set, the rest of the stock. And it'll probably be enough, especially with a character like Palutena, to kind of pull him back in where he needs to be. Joker's gonna have, like, some trouble killing, because he doesn't have that, like, big boy coming in to save him uh, from the depths. Yeah, no big scary red man here. Big man, maybe well, That's Palutena's big scary shield going to be the difference maker in this set. <laughs> I have nightmares about that thing. That's worse than Freddy Krueger, man. That shield, <laughs> broken. It's crazy right. how much like.